Ah, more pocket-sized terror. Hey, what's up, my peoples? Mgo here, the freaking geek himself, and today we will be reviewing the Transformers Siege Micromasters Rumble and Ratbat. So here we are, and there they are. And first and foremost, as always, we'll take a quick look at the packaging. As usual, you have some assemblage there in the background. Up top, we have some lovely artwork of Rumble and Ratbat. Their names are Rumble and Ratbat. Siege, War for Cybertron, Micromasters. On the bottom, things, barcodes. On the back of the box, you have your obligatory product shots, yada, 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 yada. And that's basically it for the packaging. And moving right along, here we have Rumble and Ratbat. And yes, we finally have some more of Soundwave's little minions here to play with. So here is Ratbat, here is Rumble. Yes, they're calling the red one Rumble. They're calling him Rumble. But in my mind, he'll always be Frenzy. But anyway, for the sake of the review, <laughs> we're gonna call him Rumble. <laughs> but, uh, who should we start off with? First, we'll start off with Rumble here. You can see, Don in red and black. He got some old detail throughout. And when you turn him around, hey, there he is, visible everything syndrome. Hey, how are ya? Hey. <laughs> Not much to him. There you have that. And here we have Rat Bats done in purple and black. You get some silver in there as well. A little bit of gold. And then you turn it around. Hey, visible everything syndrome. Hey, there's no hiding it. There's just no hiding it. And for comparison, uh, here is Rumble with the uh, Titans Return Rumble. And he was like a little like data pad thing going on there. And here he is with G1 Rumble slash Frenzy because he's precious. So precious. And here is Rumble and Ratbat with Ravage, Stand, Ravage, and the Beak of Laser. So, there, Stand. So, there you go. And of course, we can take them and put them into the wave of sound here. We just open that up, put Rumble in there. There you go. There's Rumble. Hooray. Although, these guys are very snug in there, though. They're, they're, they're snug. They're snug. They're snug like a bug in a rug. I'm putting a rat bat there, just so you can see what it looks like in there. There you go. Hooray! Hooray for things that sit in stuff. So, there you have that. So, that is basically it for the cassette mode. So, let's get down to transformation, shall we? <laughs> it's... <laughs> Like dominoes. Anyway. There we go. So, right, so first we'll start off with uh we'll start off with Mr. Bat here. So transform rat bat. Very, very simple. You just untab these sections of his wings, bring them down, bring the wing out, untab, bring down, bring out. You flip down his little little feet. He's got little feeties. Boop, right there. And his head is on double hinge, and you just bring it out and down, like so. And there you have Rats and Bats. We're getting close here, so we can take a look at that head. You get some gold there in the eyes, some constant there on the chest, some nice more details, some bits of silver. You can see the wings. Uh, some nice detail in there. There's tiny little feet. Oh, little feeties. And the back, you know, kind of got little thrusters back there. And articulation-wise, his head, again, is on a double hinge, so it can, you know, move up and down. You can kind of look up and down. And the wings can move in and out, and you have that hinge there. If you need it, as little feeties can move up and down. There is little rat bats. Little, little rat bats. You stay. There you go. And now, we'll bring in Rumble. And to transform Rumble, I'm just going to take his legs, bring them down, rotate the knee. Bring it down, rotate out to the knee, and then you flip out his little hands here. Flip out his little hands. Flip out his little, this one's very tight for some reason. Yeah, there we go. Flip out his little hands. And then just bring his arms out and down. Out and down. And there you have little Rumbo. He's just a little stubby guy. Look at him. Look at him. Well, we're getting close here so we can take a look at the head sculpt. You got some nice silver there on the face. Set the gun symbol. You got that gold there on the chest. The classic 
detailing there. The legs are actually nicely painted. You got that silver and gold in there. On the back, not too much to talk about. Articulation wise, this head can rotate. The arms are on a ball joint, can rotate, can move in and out. You also have that transformation joint if you need it. And the legs, they can move forward that far, back that far, outward. Of course, you can do the full splits and then some. And the knees are ball jointed, you have 90 degrees of bend, and you have rotation there if you need it. Now, Ratbat here is not uh, effects part compatible, at least not that I found anywhere. I don't see anywhere to plug the effects parts onto, but Rumble is effects parts compatible because he does have these little posts here on his fists, so you can take like this effect part here, you can plug that onto his fist. You can get some pounding action. You can have all kinds of that going on there. Like it's just you can do all kinds of that if you want. That's pretty cool. Or if you want, just saying, it's a thing. It's a thing you can do if you want to do it. You can take uh, maybe, oh, I don't know, Jetfire's effects parts. Just saying, maybe you can plug those on there like that. Maybe one on the other side, maybe. Maybe we can do that. And you can do a big old double bloosh. That's too much bloosh for one so small. That's just too much. That's too much power. That's way too much power. Anyway, he can. He can bloosh. He can bloosh. And another thing you can do if you want in tape mode, they do have these little fold down bags, just like Laserbeak and uh, Ravage did. You can plug them. Onto Soundwave, plug them onto his forearms, or onto his shoulders, whatever you want to do. It's always your toy, just play however you wish. You can just fold those down and plug them onto Soundwave, like so. And you can use his minions as shields, because, sure, why not? Sure. Sure. Dare I say, why not? Now, is there a way to perch Retbat on Soundwave? Um, not that I've found. Anyway, I, 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 don't, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, he has little grooves here on his forearms. Those are meant for laser beak, and they didn't really work for laser beak either. That's why I always use the peg, because those grooves just, boom, he fall right off. The peg actually held him on. <laughs> um, but yeah, these, these grooves definitely don't work for Rat Bat either, and there's, like, no friction going on there. Uh, I, don't, uh, I, I don't know. I saw this little, uh, you can see there's like a little slot right there in his forearm. I thought, oh, do his little tiny feet fit in there or something? But no, his little feeties are too big for that, too. I don't know. I mean, you can always just, just plop him up there on his shoulder like that. Have that going on. I, I, I don't know, man. I, I, I don't know. So there you have that. And now for comparison. Here he is. Well, here they are, rather, with a Siege Battlemaster. So you can see how they scale there. Here they are with a fellow Micromaster. Here they are with the Titan's Return. Rumble slash Frenzy. Here they are with G1 Frenzy. Because it's precious. Oh, so precious. And we'll bring in Ravage. And laser beak. And we'll bring in Papa Soundwave. And we'll get a nice little family portrait going on here. Look at that. Aren't they just the happy, happy little family? So, there you go. So there you have Rumble and Ratbat. They're two fun little figures. Uh, finally get to add to Soundwave's minions, which makes me very happy. Overall, pretty well done for what they are. Just fun little figures, fun little figures. So there you go. Now, if you would like this or any other Siege toys, you can always check out BigBadToyStore.com for availability. There will be a link in the description down below so you can check that out.
You can also check out the Siege playlist for any reviews you may have missed. Also linked in the description down below, so you can check that out as well. And I think that's it. So don't forget to check out M Games, check out Lori Plan, follow me on Twitter, all of that good stuff down in the description below. And I think that's pretty much all there is to say. So there is the Siege of Micro Masters, Ratbat, and Rumble. And this is MGO saying, remember, you don't stop playing because you grow old. You grow old because you stop playing. Be geek, be proud. Boom in your face. Hey, Soundwave, you mind if I borrow this? Um, do I have a choice? Nope. Listen, Ironhide, we don't have enough energon for a full scale assault, but. Ah! But. But what? Ah! <laughs> He's like a boomerang! It's awesome! So, what can you do? I ain't doing that. <laughs>